Rain, rain, go away. Can I record now? Seriously. Like, it will not stop raining here, and the service in here is terrible. Like, I know I'm in a swamp and it's dense and everything, but still. <laughs> anyway. Hello everyone, it is I, the one coolest man, and welcome back to more Pokemon Glazed. In the last episode, we got here to the Milkshade Swamp. With our mighty Shinx in hand. Actually, no. Actually, yeah. What was thinking no for? Look, uh, Shane the Shinx right here. He's, she's a bit hurt. Appreciate it. I also just realized that Shane's a she now. Yeah, like, one thing that happened was, while I was gone, like, this game has a weird glitch with save files. That sometimes it won't say, so I had to, like, re-record the whole first part. I can run, why am I walking? It has a weird, um, glitch with save files, and sometimes it won't save properly, so I have to do save states in order to do this properly. And yes, this is emulated, I can't do this on an actual GBA. That will require lots of hacking that I can't do. So I'm emulating this through a ROM on an emulator. And people are gonna get all butthurt about it. Eee, you're emulating! Who cares? I have to emulate to play this game anyway, so... Yeah, stop being butthurt about it. Anyway. So yeah, Shane's a female now. That... I might change her name later. To something else. Gonna, I found a crow gun. Yeah, it's awesome. I'm sorry for leaving people hanging about this, but now I'm leaving people hanging about Undertale. Ooh. Anyone who saw the last episode of Undertale knows what I'm leaving them hanging on. And they're going to be so mad at me for it. Uh, you guys have to wait. Ooh, let's slap. Anyway, you you have to wait. I'm such a mean person. Anyway, yesterday I also uploaded an update video, so if you didn't see that, to learn about some of the changes to the channel that have happened, and I've promoted a few friends of mine and another big group of people, so yeah. Check out the update video and stuff like that. And it's also where I showed off my new outro, which is going to be at the end of this video. It's a thing, so... Watch to the end to see the new outro and the music, because in the in the update video I only showed a picture. I didn't actually show off any of the music that was going to be in there. So if you want to hear the song, you gotta wait until the end. It's a really good song, and I'm glad I picked it. The song is from the lovely people from 99 Lives. Check them out. They're awesome. They make good music. Um, uh, it is off their second album. And I have permission to use Le Music, because I have a license. So yeah, I'm happy. I have music I can use. I've also been using a small bit of their music in streaming, so if you want to hear more of their music, watch me live stream. Anyway, enough talking. It's a pain wadding through this mud. Well, then, I don't know. Just do something about it. Like, leave. But Catcher Maxwell would like to battle. He sent out a Scorpion. Alright, Shane. To beat him up. Shane could probably be a girl's name. Maybe it could change to Jane. Huh. Jane. I don't know. I'm kind of grasping at straws here. I'm gonna beat up the Scorpy. We're gonna stop talking about how I mess things up. But everything is fine now. Everything is fine now. Got that, guys? It will be resolved later. And also, I actually updated my outro a little bit. I added a couple little, like, blurbs on the screen. So people would know, hey, click this, hey, click that, etc. It's hard to battle in mud. Very true. I need to go heal again, so I will be right back. Oh, come on! Found Shroomus. Don't know if I want it or not. 
might get it. Don't know yet. Probably not gonna get it. Don't really want it. Don't really care f for it. Not at all. Not in the slightest. Blah, 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 blah. Wait, now let's fight. You! This swamp is awesome! That's probably Youngster. Youngster Alex would like to battle. He's on a peach. Peach! So cute! Ah. <laughs> kind of sound like ten. Ha! Boy, I'm ten. You have sticks, uh, but ten must pay for calling. But ten gotta have sticks. Uh. You know, kind of like that. It's my Temmy voice. Do you mainly just have baby Pokemon? Cause all these are baby Pokemon so far. Pichu, Cleffa. That's adorable. You think you can hurt me with that? You'll never win if you can't kill. That came out of nowhere. Anyway, let's knock it out. Oh, oh come on! Oh, this is even funny now. You know, at least that Pichu would have been able to do something. Shane's level 12. Alright, what's last? Send out Togepi. I don't know how to do Togepi. I couldn't do Pokemon calls for crap. Like, some of them are too high for my voice. Like that. Why would I ever be able to make that sound? Seriously. I better am anyway. Kill the Togepi. Kill the Tog. God, enough of the charm. Kill it. Kill it with fire. I mean, kill it by zapping it with fire. Oh God, metronome. He's blast burn. Oh crap. Whew. Isn't blast burn like that special move that only like? Certain fire types can learn the fully evolved starters can learn. Yeah, it is. Cause it's blast burn, frenzy plant, and hydro cannon, and they're all basically hyper beam. Oh crap! Another metronome. Don't be a ground move. Teeter dan. I don't want to deal with confusion. I would have been better off with swagger. At least swagger would have brought my attack up. Also, this headset's not like completely on my head. So now that I've fixed that, I tackle him again. My phone just went off. Yes, it's dead. Thank God. It took quite a while. That defeat was crushing. I'm just waiting for Shanks to evolve at this point. Looks like some ruins here. Ooh, cut. I need cut to get through here. Oh, cool. So you came just at the right time, as I expected. Another grunt snu snuck back while our backs were turned. Look up there by the tablet. He seems very suspicious about. He must be up to no good. Do you want to see a member of Team of the Elite Four in action, Coolest? Come with me then. Inventor, it's best you stay here where you're safe. I thought I ran you scum off with your tail between your, between your legs. <laughs> I snuck back here to get the information I was looking for. Important to find. They were, they were welcoming me back in headquarters like a hero. I have no time to play games with the Pokemon League now. So long, idiots. This tablet. Are you two all right? You scared off that grunt good and proper, it seems. Wow, amazing. 
I'm done here for now. It's getting nasty. Thank you, Blank and Cools, for assisting me. Please, take this. I got a Pokecom. That Pokecom is a device of my own invention. It translates Pokemon's speech to human speech, and vice versa. It will hopefully help you on your journey. Note, trans tra text translated with the Pokemon for the Pokecom will be displayed in this color text. So remember, Pokemon speak is green. I'll be heading to my home now. I'll be much happier there where I can work in peace. See you around, coolest. These runes are amazing. Why are they here? What? What happened? Did I slip through the universe again? Oh, I thought I heard a commotion. Do you remember me? My name is Luke. I was the one who brought you back to your room last time. As predicted, you managed to slip through again. I'm kind of in a rush, so I'll hold off explaining again. Would you mind helping me? I'm looking for a mudkip that's wandered off somewhere. It's somewhere around here, but I can't find it. Anywhere. I'd appreciate it if you could look around for me. If you if you find it, I'll explain what's happening best I can. I completely forgot. Let me heal your Pokemon. Ah, thank you, Luke. Thanks for your help, coolest. I'm also going to check my bag real quick. I got 11 Pokeballs. That's way more than enough. Now, let's also... Save, just in case. I saved. Now let me save the other way too, just in case. Alright, now that I saved both ways, let's go and look for the mudkip. There it is. Come on, Mudkip. Mudkip disappeared into the mud. So it looks like we gotta run around and look for it. Oh, there's an item over here. I found Max Ether! Max Ether! That joke's getting old now. Probably something back here, and I don't know what it is. Oh, I see it. Mudkip attacked. Mudkip appeared. Go Shane. Hmm. I might catch this and use this on my team. And yes, you are actually able to catch and catch and keep this thing. I'm not kidding. Right, let's tackle it. Want to be very careful with it. Tackle. Though Shane is higher level, its defense is not the best. Ooh! That could have been bad. Rain continues to fall. Now let's bag. And ball. Because if not, I might be screwed. Oh, thank God, it only used Growl. Oof. Brain continues to fall. Ball! Oh! Dang! Why am I having trouble with this, of all things? Alright. Bag and ball! One, two, three! Ah! What's the- Ooh! Ooh, that is worth a reset right there. I will be right back. I'm back, you fuck. Luckily, if you die, you just spawn right back next to Luke. So that's good.
Yeah, I'm low on your attack, fool. Come on, let's start off a water gun. I, even I don't have an elemental attack yet. Although, if, even if I did, it wouldn't be useful on you because you're part ground type. Is Mudkip part ground to start out with? I don't remember, actually. Oh, yes. Please increase my efforts in trying to catch you. That is very useful. One more time. Actually, no. If I try again, I might kill it. Gonna catch this mud kip. Water gun bump 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 bump. Okay, I'm done. Come on, go! One. Ugh. <sighs> okay, now I'm resetting. So I just realized I wasn't recording for who knows how long. And I'm going to describe to you everything that happened. I got Mudkip, as you can see. And I crossed back over into my... Into my... Ma, into my world. Um, uh... I'm finding a trainer... I beat a bug catcher that had a... What do you have on it? He had a cocoon on him. That's right. He had a cocoon and now I'm finding another bug man. And I just... Yeah, I just got sent back to the center. Because Shinx died due to self-destruct from a Pine Co. And now I have to come all the way back here. So, yeah. At least I caught Mudkip. Oh, that means you guys missed out on me. I'm uh, reading the thing on Mudkip. The Pokedex entry on Mudkip. Uh huh. Might do that another day. Sorry, Mudkip. Your Pokedex entry will be on her just like Shinx is. Well, to be honest, I could probably just go back into the Pokedex and reread it, but I ain't gonna do none of that. Cause ain't nobody got time for that. You know what? I don't even care. I'm gonna run through here. Shane was poisoned. Max was poisoned. Shane was poisoned again. Leave. At the park. Run it. Run it. I am an Olympic runner. Doing it. Doing it. Doing it. Doing it. Doing it. Made it. Oh, champion. Well, not yet, but I'm going to be. I'm going to be champion of the Pokemon League. <laughs> I'm going to be king of the pirates. <laughs> to all the people who got that reference. <sighs> One Piece is alright, I guess. Now I'm going to get all the hate comments from people saying, One Piece isn't alright, is the best anime ever. And you suck for saying that it isn't. And you can go bite my shiny metal ass. Anyway. Mm. Anyway, now that I was done being interrupted, let's go and talk to these people. My Centret was the first Pokemon I ever caught. I love it more than any other Pokemon. I love spending time with my trainer. She's so friendly and it's great to come to the park every now and then. Strolling in the park is very common. Don't you feel at ease around here? The way that the pond sparkles is simply beautiful. I can stare at out at it all day. I want that item ball, but I need cut first. Did you come from Milkshake Swamp? I hear it's really nasty in there. Hey, aren't you a Pokemon trainer? Yes. I want to help you. Take this. I got Moo Moo Milk. Sweet. Moo Moo Milk is delicious. This one is 100 HP. Wee.
Ocherville Park is just this way. It's a great place to get fresh air without going off into the wilderness. Anyway, now that that's done, let's talk to people. I like doing this. You never know what happens. Ocherville City has a harbor, but it's not as big as the harbor in Sea Spray. I wish I had an Eevee. I heard it can evolve into seven different things, but I just want a normal Eevee. Sometimes I wish that I was younger so I could travel the world, but, but I've lived a good life, so I don't need to be sad. Cool, let's take a closer look at the world map. Here is the world map. Here, over here, we have the region we are in. But then also we have... Wait a minute. Johto League. Do not League. Evergreen. That's new. Sandwood. Whitewood. That's new. Wait. Ecrity. Hogany. Blackthorn. New bark. We got ourselves Johto in this house! Yeah, I picked another dual region game. I really shouldn't have done that after Omnicron, but uh, I'll, I'll tell you straight up. It's dope being a sailor. Boats aren't always comfortable, so I choose to stay at local hotels instead. Welcome to our bed and breakfast. Unfortunately, we're all booked. Please come back soon. Wait, what do you have to say? Hey, see those holes in the vents? You can squirm through them to get up to the old abandoned power plant. Alright, that's nice to know. Oh, hello. I usually give advice to cha trainers challenging this gym, but the gym is closed right now. The leader said he heard a commotion in the old power plant, so now we need to know where we need to go. Don't you think this city is just so quaint? I love it. Oh, whoops. Have you challenged the Ocean View Gym yet? The leader, Sparky, uses electric type Pokemon. Be wary. Oh, I'm prepared for him. Ocean View City sits right on the edge of the ocean. The salty wind feels wonderful, doesn't it? We're training to pulverize this gym, but that's not to assume it's a hard gym. Mianfu could probably pummel Sparky's jolty on him with a single blow. Surely, if you like fight, you like fighting types more than electric types, right? Fighting types are way stronger. Not in my opinion. But Kip, I swear, if someone says they like me one more time, I'm gonna kill them. I love playing with my grandpa, Pappy's Mudkip. She said you liked her. Kill her. I can't resist giving it a hug. Hello, youngster. Training Pokemon is one of the greatest joys in one's life. Treasure them. So guys, did you hear I like Mudkips? Because I like Mudkips. <laughs> I forgot to talk to that guy. I've had a crush on this guy for years. I can't believe we're finally on a date. Get out! Oh, shit. I'm so nervous. I really hope she likes me. What are you doing? Scram! Ooh, getting out of here. You're stalking them. I hate trimming these trees, but my parents promised I could get a new video game if I did them right. I feel you, bruh. Mommy said to walk at a crossword so you don't get hit on by a car. What do you mean there aren't any cars in this town? Why would there be roads if there weren't cars, silly? I don't think I've ever seen a... Well, let me rephrase what I'm about to say. I haven't seen a car in this game yet. Most people don't like cabbage, but it's not bad. It's terrible. Why, hello. Would you like to stay for dinner? I'm making a very special ca cabbage casserole. No need to look so sick. <laughs> I love some of the text in this game. Ted, isn't the ocean beautiful? Not as beautiful as you, my dear. <laughs> anyway. Boathouse. After getting on my boat, my legs feel like jelly. Makes me incapable of walking in a straight line. I know how that feels, but I'll tell that story another day. Seasickness is a common issue when sailing. A good trip is always... A good tip is to always keep an eye on land. I've always wanted to trade Pokemon. Would you trade a Ninetales for my Poliwhirl? No. It's okay, this Pokemon is very special though. Trying with my boat can be a wonderful adventure, but it can also be a little scary. Well, we're not allowed to travel by boat yet. Oh, wait, wait a second. You don't seem to spend much time in town. Why don't you go explore? So now that we've talked to everyone, next thing to do is to head to the power plant. I, oh my god, you guys know I like this theme.
whenever Lavender Town comes on, you will sit here, listen to it, and pay respects. <laughs> I had to cough, alright. Let's go. What do you have to say? I got pressured into coming in here and vandalizing this old power plant. Be careful, some of my friends are upstairs. Bring it on. Say F you. I bet you think it's pretty cool, right? Not the slightest. Do, 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 do. She has a coffee! Coffee, coffee, coffee. Coughing has levitate though, doesn't it? Oh crap. I also want to catch a Pokemon that's in here. Like I know I said I'm pretty sure I said I wanted something different this run, but I've but I've already caught one Pokemon similar to what something I had before. I kinda also want a Pokemon that might be in here. But everything in here is an electric type, so I might slide on it so that I have Shinx. I might catch myself a, a fire type later, though. The fact that you're using smog annoys me. <clears throat> and tackle. Oof. There. Yeah, good job, Max. About to use grow, god. Grow, grow, grow. Do, 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 do. Okay, enough of that. Right, I gotta step over there. Grow, god. Grow, god. Yep, lower that attack. Alright. Tackle. Grogan. Use taunt. Alright, enough referencing Krogan. Krogan's actually not that bad of a Pokemon. It probably would have made me flinch if it, if it went first. Level 13, yeah! And I learned Spark, yeah! About to send out Poochie and a. You know what? Let's keep going with. Uh, whoops. I meant to say, let's keep going with the uh, Shane here. Shane and Jane. I don't know. I'm going to change his name to something as soon as I think of. Okay. Spark it is Spark Spark! Yeah, that's the kind of raw power I was looking for. Now he's about to use another Poochiana. I'm gonna wreck this one too. Are you ready for it? You guys ready for it? I'm about to wreck it. About to one shot this shite in the butt. What, what? Preferably in the butt. Well, not seriously or literally, but you know what I'm talking about. I'm excited. I'm killing it. Doing it! Anyway, I, ooh, I need to heal. But as I'm running back to heal, I think it's time I end this episode. Also, battle! Magnemite! Um, let's run. I can't afford to battle and possibly lose. Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode of Pokemon Glaze, so I hope you all liked it. Ah, Max fainted. Darn. Anyway... That is it for this episode, so thank you all for watching! If you liked it, hit the like button and subscribe button, both at the same time, harder than- Oh, wait, I accidentally pressed B, whoops. Anyway, hit the like button and subscribe button, or and comment. I'm adding comment now because I feel like it. And comment all at the same time, harder than I am going to wreck the gym next episode! And, you guys ready? The new outro is about, to, is about to happen. So, I will see you guys later. Coolest out. New intro. Go, I mean, go, new outro. Go.